an old three JS 300. This is way better than I kind of thought. Shouldn't be riding into this too shallow. Oh, I did it! I didn't even hit it. Yeah, this thing's got the power. Oh. Welcome. How you doing jet ski brothers it's Jacob again today and uh, right now I have this guy which is an old 300 JS 300 and uh, I just got this running we'll see if it'll fire up <laughs> Seems like it idles a little high, but you know what? I think I'm gonna be able to take it for a test right now. So, um, yeah, I just sold my Kawasaki 650 swap 550, and uh, unfortunately, I got got it sold before I was able to do a lap time on it. Uh, it would have been interesting to try to compare these two head to head, but uh, yeah, from what I can tell. This is literally a 650 engine basically chopped in half. The piston and uh, everything is basically just half of that engine. So, um, But I'm going to try to take it out while I still got a little bit of tide. And I don't know, I might get a little bit of hel helmet camera footage since uh, I don't have any helpers here. So we'll see what we can do. Alright, check it out. This has some hood on it that I did some five minute paint job on for that Suzuki swapped ski. Yeah, it's on there. It doesn't actually look that bad. It looks kind of crappy. The whole ski looks pretty crappy, but, but uh, yeah, I dropped that baby in and I don't have, I gotta like race the tide cause it's going out right now. So I gotta get to it. Get to it. Oh yeah, baby. Look at it. Look at it. Well, you just look at it. Whenever I see a ski like that, I just look at it. Oh no. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, I did that. That's not good. <laughs> get it out here it's not running that ain't right and then I pulled the choke cable which I I unhooked when I was working on this thing I had to hook up a couple of the, the lines that were disconnected uh, I guess I'll just manually choke it yeah Man, looks like it's got the 550 curse once it touches the water, she don't go. So, I think grab some starting fluid or something. It's gonna go, it's gonna go. I think it'll be, I think it's gonna work. But I'm running out of time. The tide's already beached it. Wow, it really has. You gotta pull it out far. All right, baby. I'm gonna find out while I'm in like no water. Oh, come on. Really? All right. She's gonna be that way, huh? It's time for some some starter fluid, I guess. If that doesn't work, I don't know what will. Really? Oh yeah!
logs right there. Oh man. Well. Oh man, if this thing doesn't start again when I'm out here, it's gonna suck the D. Oh Lord, if this doesn't start, I'm just gonna, uh, maybe I'll jump the log on the exit. I don't know, but okay. All right, start the lap right now, Josh. Come on, baby, plane, plane. You don't even have to worry about turning since this thing is so slow. I don't know, I think basically what you do if you have one of those and you want it to be sort of a little bit better is you can put a pipe on it, which is like, I don't know, who knows if you're going to be able to find a pipe on eBay for it. But I think the bigger difference is if you put like a 38 millimeter Makuni on there, it uh, makes it pretty good. And uh, I, I do have one. It bolts right on that intake manifold. Out of the crate, they have like, it's like a 28 millimeter Makuni. It's like, the, it's like the BN38, only it's a smaller diameter, but I've got the, I've got an SBN38 square body one that I can put on there. And I think it'll work pretty good if I rejet it found jetting specs on the internet but it's also the external fuel pump kind and that one doesn't have a fuel pump in it so I gotta see if I can find one around here but that was pretty cool I'm gonna go watch the footage and see if any of it was good like if I only got like the ski in the frames I might have to go reshoot this but 
you know, because sometimes you get GoPro footage and you can't see anything and it's boring. So I'm gonna look at it for your sake. All right, you guys, that's gonna do it for the video. I hope you guys have been enjoying watching them as I wash my, uh, anyway. Yeah, tell, tell your friends, uh, Jeske Brothers got it going on. And, uh, see you next time.